Um, any new advice? Um, my advice really still the same because a lot of girls really did like hit me up and they was basically like, I needed to hear what you said because there's a lot of girls that's beginning their transition and they're around people who've already been in the transition who've probably made it to a certain point and they kind of make them feel small or make them feel like, oh girl. But again, just do you. Just do you. Go as hard as you can possibly go for your transition. Don't care what nobody thinks. Don't care what nobody feel like you look like. Make yourself look how you want to look. That's what I did. I didn't always give what heaven is giving now. Heaven gave, oof, back in the day. But now, hey, I invested. That's what you have to do. That's what's up. So say you had this imaginary crew that consisted of your, you know, your people, your, your family, your friends, you know, all your coworkers, everybody that you ever met that you love, what would you name that crew? Um, Heaven's Angels. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, that's, that's about right. Yeah. Cause that's what I really wanted my fan base to be. I wanted them to be my angels, but it kind of didn't take off. Like it didn't really pick up how I wanted it to. So it's just like, okay, whatever. But my friends, yes. Cause the friends that I have now, it's really close knit. We be around each other. We talk, we have our, of course we have our problems. We have our back and forth. We even have times where we might not talk, but it just stays at that. We don't never take stuff to the internet. We're not going back and forth. We're not airing each other's dirty laundry. So I feel like at this point in my life, the friends that I have, these are going to be the friends that are secured in my life. I don't, I don't need no new ones. I'm good with who I have. So those are my angels. They look over me. I look over them. Speaking of one of your angels, Brandy, who's been on this show and mm -hmm. we both know, <laughs> Uh, she lost, and someone who says, you know, who, who we both know stays out of drama pretty much, mm -hmm. also lost her page. Mm -hmm. How did she react to that? Brandy is kind of like, I think from being around me, she kind of adapted, or maybe it's even just the Libra. I think she kind of just was like, oh girl, whatever. She talked about it for a couple of days, but then it was just like, girl, I'm the Bugatti, honey, they gonna come back. So it was like, yes, yeah, so good, cause I do it all the time. I lose pages back to back and be right back. So, hey, we them girls. When you them girls for real, that's what happened. If you know, you know, the girls that get it, get it. That's so. awesome. Shout out to Brandy Bugatti. Hope to have you again on the show. Period, big Bugatti. Blessings and love. And Deja just lost her page too, but She'll be okay. She'll be back. Cause they was coming to her page and she didn't even really have content like that. It was just, it was just the, the fantasy, the thought of, Ooh, I wonder what, when we're going to get something from her. So she'll be okay. too. she lost her page behind that same loser ass boy. So. And who is Deja? Deja is another one of my good, good Judy's. It's her birthday today. That's the reason why I'm down here now. Cause we had a yacht party. Sunday? Yeah, Sunday. It was lit. No, you said Judy's. Yeah, like one of my good homegirls. My bitch. <laughs> I low-key be calling Deja my girlfriend, but she got a boyfriend, so, you know. How'd you guys meet? It's so crazy because um, one of my other friends, another girl that's down here, Anna Nicole, shout out to her. She lost her page too behind this loser. Um, she had a birthday party and that was my first time meeting all of them but i was ready to branch out and start meeting new girls i didn't want to be around the same people that i was around because i knew i was getting ready to revamp my whole everything about myself and i used to be looking at girls online and be like i hang with them like they look real cool so she was having a birthday dinner and she basically invited me so i was like you know what i'm gonna go for real and i really flew in and that's at the same time that i did the thing one and thing two video with Yada. So we was already supposed to link up anyway. So I was like, well, girl, we just gonna make it one big. And Deja was there. And that night, Deja and Anna were the people who I ended up leaving and going to the club with. And from there, it just was a vibe. Like me and Deja followed each other on Instagram. And then I don't even remember how it happened, but me and her ended up going out of town together, making our coins. And it was cute. Like, it was no problems. We, we agreed on everything. Everything was a bust down. It was good. 
And I really like how she's, she real laid back. She not one of those girls that, she don't do all of that. She's a bad bitch without doing all of that. So it's just, it's a vibe. It's not no competition thing. We done had a few disputes, but that's all it be. It just be, we was getting to know each other still. So she had to learn that sometimes I do come off a little aggressive when I talk, but girl, just overlook me. Sometimes it be the, the hormones. It don't, you don't gotta take it to heart. Shout out to Deja. Uh, Deja, you're definitely invited to the show. Mm -hmm. um, so you're in Miami. Any, pl any plans on uh, doing anything Miami? -ish? Well, I don't. I don't already did the Miami-ish stuff okay. because we went to. Um, we did the yacht. That was my first time being on the yacht. That was an experience. I was so drunk. It was ridiculous. Like it was my birthday. But um, did you get in the water? I got, you know the little float mm -hmm. that floats on the back of the boat? I was so scared, terrified, because I can't swim, but I wanted to be a bad bitch and get on it. So I got on it with no life jacket or nothing, and it was okay, it was cool. I was stationed in one spot, but it was cool. Did you post pictures? Yes, nice. a lot. <laughs> I got videos and everything. Shout out to you. Mm -hmm. All right, well, of course you're always invited to come to the show. Thanks mm -hmm. for coming again. Period. Much love. Thanks for holding space. Period. Until next time. Holla. <laughs> oh my lord. Dope, dope. I seem like I talked so much on this one. No, you had to get some shit off your chest. Ugh. <laughs>